Hello, everyone. Today, we would like to introduce how to use our relay test set together with accessory to do the energy meter testing. We know that in the field testing, normally when you do protection relay testing, at the same time, it shall need to test energy meters too. So for this purpose, we developed the energy meter module in our power test software so that the engineers can use the relay test set to test the energy meter as well. In part one, we will show how to test the energy meter with pulse output. For this kind of energy meter, we normally connect the energy meter with pulse output to our binary input. Firstly, we open the testing module energy meter. Go to the system set for rated voltage and current setting. Here we can do the setting according to energy meter parameters, such as the type, unit, and the secondary meter. Select a kilowatt per hour. Set 3200 for constant. Then set the phase, because this meter is single phase, so we use LA. Then set the testing current and voltage. And you must set as percentage of IN and VN or set in value. Select one testing point to check the wiring. Here we can see the wiring connection between the relay test set and the single phase electronic energy meter. We can see the pulse counter increased with energy meter pulse output. Now the first test point is completed and the result is passed. Then we can set more testing points with parameters one by one. and delete the unnecessary testing points. Right-click the mouse and use Select All to select all the testing points. And before the testing, we can set the assessment accuracy. Then click F2 to start the testing. And all the selected testing points will be tested one by one automatically. And after each testing, uh, the software will give the assessment pass or fail in the software interface. Now all testing points are completed and the results are all OK. Then we can generate a complete report to check more testing data in the report. After checking the report, we can save the report in RPT default format. 
Next time when you need to do the same testing, you can just open the default uh, report format RPT file uh, from the power test software and clear all the result and run the same testing, which is uh, very efficient and convenient. And in part two, we will introduce how to test the energy meter with LED output. For testing the energy meter with LED output, we may need an accessory named PACB108, which is a scanning head and a converter box, can work together with our relay test set for testing this kind of energy meter. Here is the wiring connection between relay test set and PACB108 and the energy meter. We use the scanning head sensor to LED of the energy meter. And the scanning head is connected to the converter box and the converter box output connect to the relay test set binary input. For this energy meter, we also use the energy meter testing module for the testing. Since this energy meter is with the same parameter as last one in part one, so we can directly use the uh, report uh, file, RPT file we just uh, saved to test this meter as well. We can just uh, open the RPT report file and uh, clear all the results to run the same testing again. At this time, during the testing process, you can see the scanning head and the LED blinking simultaneously. All test points are completed and the results are all OK. Then we can generate the report to view and save it. And in part 3, we will show how to test the mechanical energy meter with the disk. When testing this kind of energy meter, the energy meter must be installed vertically. Use the scanning head to scan the line of the disk. When the scanning light focus to the disk line, and this picture show focus is OK. If the focus light is like this photo, it means the focus is bad. And we need to make sure the focus light is good before the testing. And for this energy meter, our engineer added one template for it. So in this part, we will show how to use the uh, template for the testing. Firstly, we open the template in the power test software. We select one testing point to check the focus and the sensitivity of the PACB108 first. Click wrong button to start the injection. And after the injection, we can see the disk is running and we can adjust the sensitivity. Our testing experience is to adjust until the LED is on and then back a little bit to turn off the LED. Then wait for the line of the disk to pass and see if the scanning head flashes in the same time or not. If it flashes simultaneously, then it means the adjustment is completed. Then we can stop the injection and select all the testing points to check the energy meter.
During the testing process, we can see that uh, the testing points is running one by one, and the test results is coming out one by one. All the testing points are completed and the testing results are correct. Then we can view the test report and save the report. And also, if you need the word format report, we can save the report in word format as well. That's all for the introduction of testing energy meter with Panovo's relay test set. Thanks for watching, and if you need any assistance, please feel free to contact us anytime.